Good morning. Good morning. I am gonna make breakfast muffins. I know Aubrey already made pancakes apparently, but I've been really wanting our breakfast muffins, so I'm gonna go ahead and whip up some breakfast muffins for a little day of eating. I'm gonna put a little counter on how many times you say breakfast muffins. So these are the muffins that we have another video on. Aubrey and I make them frequently because they're quick, convenient, and even Letty will eat them. It's a chocolate croissant. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Just a bite, though. I'm gonna give it back. Let me try it this way. Okay. Mm. <laughs> you didn't, you didn't get the chocolate, though. It is the chocolate. Oh, take a bite. Right there. Right there. Mm. <laughs> 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 Yeah, you can have it when we, we bake them. We gotta bake them. Oh, yeah, cool, da, da, da. All right. <laughs> I wanted to film a full day of eating video today um, just because I have a pretty hectic schedule normally, and I know a lot of you guys do too. So, you always. I'm gonna practice this. We're gonna do this in as I was saying, it's always a hectic time, especially mornings. I wanted to film a full day of eating so that I can give you an idea of like what we do to eat. All of our meals also have to function for meals that Letty will want to eat. Usually have to be like quick and convenient for us. So. There we go. So we just store them up like this and then we just reheat them whenever it's breakfast time. And I have one over here that I'm eating right now. So I just got back from the gym and then I went from the gym to my parents' warehouse to borrow a box truck. We're taking some stuff from our warehouse and moving it to another warehouse that we have that's across the street so we can just kind of free up some space on site. So I'm making a protein shake for me and Adam was like, make me one too. So I'm making a protein shake for him too. Normal two scoops of protein, reds, greens, magnesium, creatine. Yep. From pscience.com, just gonna go bread. Like comment down below what kind of milk you drink. I have some friends that are like, I will not drink 2% or fat free. It tastes like just watery milk. And then like, when I drink whole milk, I'm like, oh my goodness. There's a lot of things I feel like subconsciously, like my, I think my disdain for peanut butter comes down to like the calorie content in peanut butter. Is that bad? Yeah, I, like I two tablespoons, know. like 200 calories. Oh, yeah. No wonder I'm getting sick. Yeah. <laughs> and people say it's like a protein food, but it has like three, three or five grams of protein. and so that's like 20 calories are from protein of the 200, like not even 10%. It's not a protein. Peanuts are fat. Aubrey and I's go-to lunch is usually leftovers from the night before. We made some rice and ground beef. I don't really track macros anymore. I kind of just eat intuitively. However, I want to say if you don't track macros, then sometimes you don't really understand where your calories are sneaking up on you. Like I was explaining to Eastman earlier how an extra tablespoon of peanut butter is like 100 extra calories. Uh, you just have to be careful that whenever you're making yourself a peanut butter and jelly sandwich or something like that, you know, that's a, sometimes you end up getting 800 calories from this sandwich. Salad's another really big one. A lot of people will put like cheese and nuts and croutons in their salad and the, the dressing is very fatty and they'll douse it in dressing. That's another place that you can really get screwed up if you're not tracking macros or understand the content of those foods. With that being said, like the best thing to do is like track macros 100% for a while so you understand like just by looking at things like how much chicken, how much steak is four ounces and then steak, like what is the fat content of steak? Well, what's the fat content of chicken? Like what is, a cup of rice really look like. I think that that's just, you get familiar with it and then you don't have to do it as strict anymore, but you have to adhere. It's like a learning phase. 
Eating on the go. I just made a reel for Fat and Weird where we stuffed cookie dough and croissants. And I've probably eaten an entire croissant with cookie dough. So, add that in. It is dinner time, so Aubrey has been getting these home chefs and tonight we're making chicken parmesan one and I'm super excited. I love chicken parmesan. Letty is helping. This is a kid's knife, I promise. You wanna do it yourself? You're such a good helper, Letty. You're a cook. She chopped up all those. Uh, I have made my salad right here, which is just some cucumbers, uh, iceberg mix, tomatoes, and honey mustard. Ken's light honey mustard, the best. All right, mix it around with your hands. You eating it? Yeah, you gotta make it around. Are you recording? Yeah, what are you doing? Why are you eating a block of cheese? Are you eating cheese? You like Parmesan? Is it good? Yeah, she doesn't like soft cheeses, right? Dinner is served, right? Can you see it? Yeah. Letty did a great job. Letty cut up those zucchinis perfectly. Good job. A bite of chicken and a zucchini. Roll it up. See? I'm gonna put y'all on something. Greek yogurt doesn't taste that great, but if you add a stick of Versalite to it, it tastes really good. And this bowl of yogurt is usually my nightcap. I may sneak a little bit of candy because if you haven't seen our candy cabinet or candy drawer, no, we got a lot of candy. Um, but that's it. Hope you enjoyed this full day of eating video. I know that like I don't really eat that much in the mornings and then I just consume a lot more in the afternoon and evening, but that's just what works for me. Um, comment down below if you uh, like this video because full day of eatings are easy to do because I eat every day. Subscribe if you haven't, you're worth it. Already ended the video, but you know, we have our late night snack. Palm corn with Cheetos. Just a little bit of Cheetos. You want some cheddar powder? Okay, now I'm really done for the night.